I think we did pretty good today. Maybe, but distance runners did so much better. And we ran two miles without stopping. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, the sprinters get to take breaks. You're so full of yourself, and you don't even realize okay. it. Okay. <laughs> what are we talking about here? Okay, the distance runners are definitely better. No, the sprinters are a lot better. Oh my goodness. Okay, you two cut it out with the competition. Good morning, my magnificent mathematicians. I'm so excited to be with you this morning. We are going to have so much fun today learning more about math and growing our brains. So I have the privilege today of having my kiddos, Hayden and Hallie, here with me. They just got back from running with their friends on the track teams. So Hayden runs cross country, but then in the spring he runs track, and you run long distance races. Yep. Um, and Hallie, you are more of a sprinter, right? Like you would rather run shorter distances, but try to go like zoom, zoom, super yeah. fast. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> Okay, so Hayden, what did your team do today? We ran two miles for time. Oh, for time. So explain to me kind of what, what that means. How is that different? So we run without stopping to try to get a new best time. So I've heard you talk about your PR. Yeah. So like your personal, personal record. record. Yeah. Okay. And did you set a PR today? Almost. Pretty close? Yeah. It was one of your better times? Okay, good job. Um, how did you do? Like. Well, it was really hot outside, so that was part of it, but we definitely did better than the sprinters. Oh, gosh. Okay, Hallie, how did the sprinters do today? How was practice? We did really good. We ran 16 220 yard sprints. Hayden, I know it seems shorter, but I know we ran more than y'all today. We just ran it faster. We definitely didn't do more. <laughs> well, I'm actually curious about that. Who, who did run more today? Um, let's maybe compare see what both of y'all ran. Okay. Um, okay, so to do that, we would need to get Hayden's long distance run converted from miles into feet, and we need to get Hallie's shorter distance runs converted from yards into feet. Okay, Hayden, you ran two full miles, right? All two miles of it. <laughs> okay, so there are 5,280 feet in one mile. To convert to feet, let's multiply two miles times 5,280 feet per mile, and that gives us a total of 10,560 feet. That is a lot of running. I'm proud of you. I'm better than her. And no stops. Even after the first mile, you don't get a little break. Nope. Oh, woo. okay. Let's check on Hallie. So you ran 16 of your sprints today? Yes. Okay, so 16 220 yard sprints. First, let's convert yards to feet. Now we know that there are three feet in a yard. So to convert to feet, let's multiply 220 yards times three feet. And that gives us 660 feet and you ran 16. Yes. Okay, so 16 sprints times 660 feet per sprint gives us a total of, oh my goodness, 10,560 feet. So congratulations, you two, you tied. Yeah. Okay, but she also got breaks. <laughs> but she did run faster. No yeah. way. I, mean, I ran faster. Okay, but she couldn't run the whole two miles. It doesn't matter. Started. I ran faster. I ran faster. It's okay. Y'all are a little bit red-faced. Are you still thirsty? Yeah. Yes, I'm thirstier, though, because I ran harder. So. You know what? I've got my gallon jug of water over there. Yep, hand that to me, Hayden. Thank Whoa. you. I wonder how many servings we could get out of this big gallon jug of water. Hayden, how many ounces does the water bottle say that it has in it? Um, it says about 16 ounces. Okay. Wait, how many ounces are in one gallon of water? Um, this says 64 ounces in a gallon. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got 64 ounces in one gallon. Let's divide 64 ounces by the 16 ounces in the water bottle. Put that in the calculator and we get Four, exactly four, perfect. So we could take this gallon jug of water and divide it equally into four of those water bottles. And I'll be happy to share. And the fact yeah. that it divides into four is perfect. So each of you can get a refill and, and then Harper and I will have enough for the two of us to also have 16 ounces yeah. of water. And Harper and I were talking about going on a jog today. 
like here in just a minute. Do y'all want to go with us? No, definitely. I want to go. Personally, I don't want him coming. Are you scared I'm going to beat you or something? Oh, okay. No, no, it's just no. Kind of no. Y'all, let's just go on a family jog together and have fun. It's not a competition. Sound good? Sure. Team post? Yeah. Still going to beat her. <laughs> That's all the time that we have for today. Uh, magnificent mathematicians, great job growing your brain with me. I hope that you have an incredible day today. And maybe you can get outside and go on a walk yeah. or a jog or a sprint too. If you want to try to run what Hallie is used to running as a sprinter, then you can go out into your community, um, maybe find a track. And if you were to run a 220-yard sprint, that would be about half of a lap around the track, right? Yep. And a sprint means you are running as hard as you can the whole way. It'll probably take you at least 30 seconds to get around half of a lap. If you want to try what Hayden runs, then a full mile, one mile, is how many laps around the track? Four laps, so two miles would be eight laps. Okay, so if you want to try what Hayden is used to running, you would have to run eight full laps around the track without stopping. Okay, I'm ready for our family jog. We're gonna, we're gonna be positive and have a good time doing it. All right, it's been so good to see you, and we will see you again next time on Rise and Shine. Your grace could be helping out the truth and I will shine.